Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another edition of NDNWS. I'm your reporter, Carter Haas, and we're going to get right to the weather and some weather tips, too. So be care So watch out for that, I should say, and uh, let's get started. So December 21st, we're going to see a storm. It could bring nine inches of snow, which I know is a lot, but what do you expect? It's North Dakota. In the Valley City, Fargo, Jamestown area, I-94 area, I should say. Uh, some models, very few long-range and very, 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 very few short-range. Long-range is a little bit more inaccurate, but short-range a little bit more accurate. Uh, they are predicting that it can move up north. If that happens, then just Grand Forks, you know, 15 miles south of Valley City, Fargo, and Jamestown, those kind of areas, be be ready for a winter storm warning. Uh, just that snow, that heavier snow to hit you. It's going to be a very short-lived storm, so kind of be prepared for it to go by really quick, but bring a lot of snow while it does. Eight, you know, the last storm that we saw kind of the, in the Lisbon area, expect that yet hitting the Valley City area. If it does, like I said, nine inches of snow, a little bit of drifting, wind isn't going to be too bad. Uh, the roads could be a little bit some roads could be closed. Uh, if there are any schools open, I would expect a two-hour delay, one-hour delay, or complete school closure in those areas that it really gets heavy. And uh, I don't, I don't really. It's going to be happening in the morning, so probably not complete school closures. Other than that, be mindful of that. Uh, December itself, I just have to say this: December twenty-eighth, watch out for a storm. But December itself is going to be very unstable. The rest of it is going to be very. The atmosphere is going to be very unstable. So Christmas time, Christmas Eve, December 28th and December 30th, watch out for those kind of pop-up storms because right now the radar is very just everywhere on storms and it's very irritating, but it's just kind of what we have to, excuse me, what we have to deal with at this point in time. So there's really not much else I can say than that. Just watch out for those pop-up storms. Other than that, winter weather tips, any snow on the ground, shovel it right now. Please shovel it because it's going to freeze and compact overnight and that's going to just be horrible to have to shovel the next day. So shovel it now while you can and um, any snow that does occur, you know, in the next few days, any snow that does fall, shovel it too. And get that snow right now away from your house because it's really starting to freeze and compact. And if you can get it away from your house now, that's good. So then some of that fluffy snow that you put on top doesn't drift back in. And, uh, yeah, that is that is very irritating. I shoveled some past kind of up by the barn, the shop, behind the barn, kind of where we store our snow equipment so we can get access to that. If I were you, you if you live on the country, you just, you live in a place where you might need a little walk path to get to a certain building, make it, do it. Uh, the ground is pretty much frozen, so go ahead with it. Uh, other than that, there's not much more tips I have for you guys rather than just shovel smartly, be smart about the cold weather and uh, just be prepared for that heavy snow to occur because of how cold it is those flakes are going to be very fluffy and big so other than that it's all i got for you guys today thank you for watching and have an amazing christmas i'm your meteorologist carter house signing off